What is Atom Beam? Atom Beam is a revolutionary AI-based software that has the potential to change the way a lot of data is transmitted, especially Internet of Things data, uh, IoT. It does what legacy compression algorithms cannot do, which is dramatically reduce the size of small units of data. For IoT, we can usually reduce the size of transmitted data by 75% or so. And we can usually reduce the size of other kinds of transmitted data by 60% and often more. By way of comparison, the most advanced compression usually only reduces those kinds of data by 10, 20%. How does Atom Beam work? Well, Atom Beam uses machine learning to identify repetitive patterns in sample data, and then it stores those patterns, which we call source blocks, in a code book. Then we identify each source block in the code book with a small index, which we call a code word. When Atom Beam has completed its training, we take the identical copies of the code book along with the Atom Beam software, of course, and we load it into the source, such as an IoT sensor, and into the destination, such as a server in the data center. Now, when the sensor generates the data, Atom Beam translates that data into code words that are sent off from the, the sensor to the destination server, and the server receives the code words and instantly rebuilds the original data using its identical codebook. It's like they have their own private shorthand language. In Atom Beam, data, the code is very small and light, and it can fit in a very simple little sensor. So why not just use compression? Well, that is a good question. Compression algorithms have been around a long time, and when you are talking about big files, compression is effective. But for small files, compression just doesn't work. The problem is compression only looks for patterns in one file at a time, such as an IoT message, which are very small and don't have much room to have repeated patterns. Now, in contrast, Atom Beam's machine learning looks for patterns in thousands of messages, and so we find vastly more repeated patterns. That's why compression doesn't work on small data units. But Atom Beam's compaction is very effective. For Atom Beam, the performance is pretty much the same, whether the files are 100 bytes or 100 megabytes. What problem does Atom Beam solve? The rate of data growth is tremendous, and the biggest source of future data growth is IoT and other small data units. In 2025, IoT will generate 90 zettabytes or over half of all the data that's generated in that year. One zettabyte equals a thousand exabytes. And if you were to look at all the words that were ever spoken by human beings in all of history, it adds up to only five exabytes. So 90 zettabytes is a lot of small data units. But up to now, there hasn't been any way to make those short bursts of data any smaller, at least when the devices are sending it. Now, if you could shrink the size of the data you're sending, lots of good things happen. It's faster. Sending half as much data means you're doubling the speed. And it costs a lot less because you're not using nearly as much bandwidth. Atom Beam can cut cellular costs 50%, sometimes more, or you can just send a lot more data. There are massive economies you can realize compared to paying carrier bills, or building out more infrastructure. Why should customers use Atom Beam? Well, there's a big variety of customers who would benefit from Atom Beam. Any user of a network that spends SOL units of data, such as IoT, regular internet data, credit cards, connected cars, telemetry, there's a lot of customers who would see real benefits. And the bottom line is, if you transfer data over the air, for instance, like in a cellular network or over a satellite, Atom Beam can cut your costs, speed up your data, and radically transform your network. Our customers think it's miraculous. At first, they don't believe it, and then they test it, and then they realize that everything really is radically different and in a good way. And then there are other benefits, too. 
Security is greatly enhanced because every code book is different and therefore the code words are different for every code book and they're indecipherable for a hacker that intercepts them. They wouldn't even know what they were. If you operate an IoT network, your sensors will be twice, can be twice as far from the node. On average, you can expect your batteries to last 25% longer because you are using less battery power and transmitting data. A satellite user operating thousands of sensors could save millions of dollars. Uh, point of sale mach car credit card machines can go twice as fast. So can financial trading orders. There's a long list. Think about this example that I heard the other day. Cisco says that one house in 2020 will generate as much internet traffic as the entire internet did in 2008. 2008, we're not talking 1998. And the biggest increase is coming from small unit data, especially IoT. Atom Beam's compaction is the only way that data can be transmitted in significantly reduced form. Here's another example. Most of the data that goes through low power WAN networks moves at a rate literally thousands of times slower than a fast Wi-Fi connection, and it's super constrained on how much data it can carry. Atom Beam can make that data move four times faster and therefore effectively expand the pipe by four times with no investment at all in any hardware. Let's take another example. Let's say you're shipping pallets of food over water and you use IoT over satellites to track temperature, vibration, humidity, and so forth. You might be spending $30 a month per sensor and you might have thousands of sensors we could probably cut your costs in half and you'd save millions. There's lots of examples like this. Atom Beam replaces literally billions of dollars worth of infrastructure with a little piece of software. It's simple to test it on your data. Check us out at atombeamtech.com.